going on guys d21 Delhi here back again with another mlb the show 21 video and in this video guys i'm gonna show you how to get free diamonds for your squad we all need these diamonds bro so we can rank up in rank season so i'm gonna show you guys the quickest way and the best method to get the free diamonds but before we begin this video guys if you guys do end up enjoying this video bro make sure you guys are smashing that like button if you guys are new to the channel bro welcome go subscribe hit that notification bell to be notified on my upcoming videos so let's get right into this video guys with the quickest way Way to earn free diamonds so number one thing you guys are going to want to do and in my opinion really the only <laughs> way you can really do this to get good quality diamonds obviously okay so you get a free diamond here just having the game um roberto clemente when you pre-order it so that's cool and all that it's actually going to be there for seven days so actually i don't even think you needed to pre-order it so you get a free diamond with roberto clemente pretty good stats and stuff like that very, very good fielding but most importantly guys you guys are going to want to go um all the all the way to programs and you guys want to go team infinity all of these team infinities okay i'm not even completed with them yet because it takes quite some time but you guys can get these free diamonds just playing showdowns so you guys go here you get jordan alvarez david fletcher jesus luzardo kyle lewis joey gallo these are look at these stats bro 96 power versus right 98 power versus left joey gallo we already know how cheesy that card is honestly so you can literally go through all these diamonds just by playing showdowns. Um, showdowns will give you vouchers and each voucher is three um, team affinity coins, I guess you can call them. And with these coins, you literally, you once you finish a whole showdown, you basically get um, five vouchers. So five times three is 15. So you're going to end up with 15 team affinity coins. So just playing one showdown, which is pretty quick, um, takes probably like less than 30 minutes um will get you all already right here you do it again it'll take you all the way to 30 you do it again it'll take you all the way to 50 and then all you guys really need to do is finish these moments of each players so right here kyle lewis two extra base hits doable strike out eight batters with lozardo you know tally two extra base hits with jordan alvarez hit a home run with joey gallo these are easy things that you guys can do probably takes like 15 minutes honestly maybe the the lozardo one will take a little bit but pretty easy stuff right here two coins two coins two coins two coins two coins so we got um five five times two ten so we got ten right here so that'll move you all the way to 60 and you guys can basically do that with everybody bro moments finish all of these moments right here that'll give you 10 coins you guys can also finish conquest and stuff like that but i really don't recommend conquest i don't like it i'm not a fan of it you guys can play some March to October as well. Again, not a fan of it either. I feel like there's a lot more quicker ways that you guys can do it. As well as, guys, finish up your collections. You collect all these players for each team in the in the AO East. And you get three right here for the Orioles. You get four for the Red Sox. You get seven for the Yankees. Obviously, the Yankees is going to be a lot more um, harder because you obviously have four diamonds there. But the Rays, one diamond. The Blue Jays, one diamond. Red Sox, one diamond. Orioles don't even have a diamond. They only have silver. So you can easily finish up the Orioles and get three Team Infinity coins right there. And obviously, guys, do some of the exchanges. I already completed for the AO East players. I already completed one half of the of the exchanges. So I only need to do it again two more times, basically. But look at this. You get five Team Infinity coins. Then here, if you do it again, you get 10 um, Team Infinity coins. And then you do it a third time, you get 15. So that itself, 25... That itself right here, just doing exchanges, will give you 30 Tim Infinity cards. Then you do two showdowns and you're already there. And you're already going to get these free diamonds, bro. And these diamonds are worth it, bro. These diamonds are worth it. Trust me. They're very good diamonds, at least for now, to start things off. And the most important part, guys, is that these are free diamonds. Okay, you cannot buy them in the market and you cannot sell them in the market. So this is the only way you guys can basically get them. Obviously, you will eventually level up and get it when you play the game. But if you want it to be quick and you want to get these cards, like, look, I have John Carlos Stadion on my team. He's hitting for me. 545 with two home runs the guy's an absolute animal all right you got here willie adamas very good shortstop as well you guys can even throw him over there at second base 80 fielding 81 power versus right 82 power versus left these cards are very good bro anthony santander switch hitter right fielder good power good fielding overall very good player these are three diamonds right there you guys can just get plus you guys will get rewards along the way so you guys are going to be able to get these gold cards this big poppy one rakes 92 power versus right 87 power versus left 
this Evan Longoria rakes as well. You guys can get a whole bunch of rewards here. A Balling as a Habit pack, a Team Infinity pack, another Balling as a Habit pack, another Team Infinity pack. You guys will get a whole bunch of um, rewards just by playing showdowns and just by doing all that stuff. Plus, you guys get a whole bunch of XP and a whole bunch of stubs and stuff like that. So, like I said, do your showdowns, do your um, your collections, do the exchanges, get those vouchers, bro. And I promise you guys, you guys will get all these free diamonds. It's going to take some time, though, not going to lie to you. It will take some time. I literally spent the first day that I got the game just doing showdowns and just doing all that. And I'm still, like, ha not even halfway done. Um, I just don't put 800 bucks into the game just to get Chipper Jones and show it off to you guys. I'm not like that. I, I always do a no-money-spent account. Um, every single time I play MLB The Show, just because I like grinding the game, I don't pay my way to win. So if you guys are like me in that aspect, you guys should do your showdowns, do your collections, do your team infinities, and get all that stuff done, bro. If you guys need a second basement, a very good second basement, you guys are going to want to do the NL West. So this is what I've been doing. I basically go with what I need. I needed two outfielders um, to play alongside Ken Griffey Jr. because that was the only diamond I had. So I went with Giancarlo Stadden and I went with Joey Gallo, two cards that absolutely rake. Now I need a second basement, so I'm going to start grinding for Max Muncy. I feel like Max Muncy is the best second basement um, in the game. Obviously, he plays first base here, but you can always move him over to second. He has 78 fielding. He has 100 power versus right, power, 97 power versus left. And again, 88 overall, best diamond second baseman you guys are going to find other than Alfonso Soriano, when you eventually get Alfonso Soriano, you guys can throw him in there at second base. But for now, if you have a no money spent account like me, Max Muncy is the guy you guys want to go to. I would do that. Just go with what your team needs. But these are free diamonds, guys. These you cannot buy in the market and you cannot sell them in the market. These are all free. As long as you play the game and you actually grind the game, grind the showdowns. And if you guys have stubs and you guys want to waste some stubs on doing those exchanges, then go for it. That will help you guys avoid some showdowns because I know showdowns can get very annoying sometimes. It can get boring. But guys, it's free diamonds, bro, at the end of the day. So that's going to be it for the video, guys. If this video did help you guys out, make sure you guys leave this video a thumbs up. And if you guys are new to the channel, bro, don't forget to go subscribe. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.